The door must be opened. The great empath awaits. Faith, honey, please, make them stop. All we need is a key. Eric, get Faith! Get out of my way! Go get your daughter. Mommy? I think you should go now. The Great Empath calls to us. Faith? Faith! Take me back! Take me back! you out. But you have to promise to be good. Okay. <sighs> Hi, Mama. Hi, Angel. Can you be a good boy and go play? How are you holding up? Just barely. How about some tea? I used to make tea for my Asta when she was feeling down. She had trouble at school with the other children, and... Hey. We'll find a way to help him. I promise. Thank you, Olivia. Why is she here? Angel, what are you talking about? We don't want her here anymore! Orson, Olivia has been through so much with us. She's helped us, and... No! Go away! Orson! Are you okay? Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Let's get him upstairs. them. Just leave Astrid alone, please. You can't do anything without me. I never asked for you to come. Yes, you did. Countless times. You're too weak to survive without me. You're a fucking liar. Ava might have pulled the trigger, but you trapped her prey. You lured your friends to town in exchange for a few pills. A prank, she called it. I didn't know what she was doing. And while your friends laid there full of holes, dying, you were off using like a fucking chunky. And then I was born. I kept us going. I kept us alive. I don't have to listen to this. Then listen to me strangle the air from your sister's lungs.
tell me, do you love me or Rachel? I still love Rachel. I belong with her. I'm sorry. I should have known. Eric was, uh, just filling me in on the plan. We should go. Uh, yeah. Look, Rachel. If something happens and we don't make it, I just want you to know that, despite everything, I love you and want us to be together. We need to get moving. Yeah. 